So this blade does come in different color and handle material options. So there is a few different flavors. Now, as far as the knife goes, I'm really, really liking this one. I think this is an awesome, not only awesome design, but it's also a very useful and practical design. It works really good. It's gonna be super versatile for most people, you know, especially for just a regular light duty knife, which, you know, most people are using their knife for anyways. You know, it's obviously not gonna be a hard use knife, but as far as just regular cut tool man this thing is awesome and i think this would be like the type of knife most people are wanting to carry day to day now this is the sativian st995 an m390 titanium and carbon fiber we'll get back to the blade here in one second we have a full bolster lock so it is a bolster but it's not a bolster lock because it is stainless steel liners so it has stainless steel liners a titanium bolster plate Shred carbon fiber, and like I said, it does come in different handle materials, so this is just one option. Um, titanium mill pocket clip that works great in and out of the pocket, super smooth, and it, it's nice and tight, like there's no wiggle, no movement, even though there's only one screw. Titanium backspacer with a hidden lanyard pin. Now the blade is a spear point blade with really thin, nice geometry. The tip is nice and pokey. Um, it's gonna be great for utility cutting and slicing. Then you back up here to the ergonomics, very, very neutral ergos. This is gonna be good in just about every grip. Because it has this neutral, the weight, because it's a neutral grip and it kind of teardrops right here or it rounds off, it's gonna be very nice in the palm, whether you're doing utility cuts, whether you're slicing, you know, even if you're doing, you know, strap cutting and things like that, where you're doing pull cuts, it, it's gonna work great. Sharp inch home plunge grind is beautiful. Love how they did that. They did a good job with that, especially because it's so thin behind the edge. You're gonna be able to get a few sharpenings before you hit the plunge grind. The action is ridiculous. It's great. Phenomenal action. They did a nice, comfortable, low profile flipper. And it's, it's like I said, it's very comfortable. It does have some, some grip to it. So you can kind of do the in between the push button light switch. You can light switch it or push button it, but it kind of feels good to kind of do the, the mix. And yeah, the, the, the flipper tab works great. Then I love that they put a fuller on this because I love a nice spear point blade like this with a fuller. Not only do I think it's attractive with this swedge and everything, but it makes it functional. Great reverse flick. The detent is well tuned for both deployments. Now thumb flick, not gonna be the easiest, but you can do it. You gotta catch, get your finger down a little bit low, but eh, you can do it, but it's, the, it's better for a reverse flick. Anyways. So the flipper tab, because it's low profile, you can go over the top of it, you know, relatively comfortable. You know, it might be a little bit pokey for you, but it's pretty good. As far as the drop, it is very, very smooth on the drop with its ball bearing pivot. Very, very smooth. Rock solid lockup, no play, any direction. Really happy to see that. Now, as far as a couple negatives go, because there's always gonna be some negatives, right? One, I wish there was better access to the lock bar. Not that it's bad, I can easily do it. I just wanna be clear about that. It's very easy to disengage, but I wish this one was, this liner on this side was knocked back so that I can get better access to this side. You know, just knock it back a little bit. You don't even have to cut this out, even though I'd prefer this to be cut out, but even if this wasn't cut out, just cut back the liner a little bit. It'd be easier, oh, it'd be easier to get to. Um, next thing, I kind of wish the liners were thicker. I also, man, I would really love to see, and I hope I can encourage them to turn this whole knife into a bolster lock. No liners, just a titanium bolster lock. That would be amazing because that way it would be a frame lock rather than a liner lock. I'm not a big fan of thin, thin liners like this. Now it's a light duty knife, so I'm not mad at it. It's fine and it works great, uh, but I would prefer thicker liners. The next thing, as far as negatives go, is the M390 steel. It's gonna be a bit on the softer side. Now, I can't complain too much for the price. The price is right on this. This is a good price. You're, you're, you're not gonna get M, you know, premium M390 quality out of this. You know, as far as edge retention goes, you're gonna get the other benefits that it has um, as far as uh, stain, resistance, stain resistance, but as far as edge retention goes, it's probably gonna be more so like S35VN, if not maybe a little bit lower. But for the price, 
you know, you're not paying premium price for a premium steel here. So you're getting a premium steel that's heat treated a little bit on the softer, quite a bit on the softer side, which is going to make it have, you know, lower edge retention. So you're not buying this to, to feel, uh, M390's qualities. You're not doing that. You're going to get it to have, you know, a decent steel with a great build, great functional design, super lightweight. I do kind of wish they would have did lefties or a lefty clip because it is so easy to use left-handed. Um, so they didn't do that. But all in all, all in all, you know, aside from the couple things I mentioned, this... Even with a couple of the things I mentioned, this thing is still really good. And I love the look of it. This is just a, a good looking knife that's gonna be functional for most people's tasks. This is a knife that most people could put in their pocket and it'd be a great knife for them. Like I said, it is a light duty knife. You know, it's not gonna be a hard use knife, but as far as what majority of people use their knives for, opening up packages, cutting this, cutting that, cutting an apple, whatever, this is going to be great. So work hard, stay tough. Society's relying on you. Until next time, peace.